In this video, we will look over how to open up an MP3 file recorded from NC Simul Machine. Here I have an MP3 file that's been recorded from a demonstration video. When I double click on the file, NC Simul Player automatically loads. Here in the player, we're able to zoom, pan, and rotate just like we would in NC Simul without the use of a license. Here I can turn on the toolpath preview for all the tools or just a single tool here, just like in NC Simul. We have the same link with the 3D window, the program window, and the information window as we do in NC Simul. Here when I click on the over travels, NC Simul shows us where the over travel is, highlighting also the wireframe. Here if I hold the down arrow, NC Simul will remove the material on the piece. If we want to take a measurement, we can simply go into our analysis tab and have several different types of measurements that we can perform. Here I'm going to do a point to plane measurement and measure how much this tool has just cut. This face to this face is shown in my measurement tab below. Next I'm going to do a hole to hole measurement from the center of this hole to this hole here. Again, the value is shown in the measuring tab. Next, we're going to run the simulation by just simply clicking begin and then play. Once we click play, the material removal begins. Here I can speed up or slow down the simulation as I choose. And as we can see, the kinematics of the machine are the same as in NC Simul machine. Here with this axis motion, if I'd like to pause, I can go back into the program and slowly animate that axis motion. This is very important so the operator knows exactly how the machine will behave with this program. Here the simulation is still active. All I need to do is just continue by clicking play. Here I can switch from my machine view to my table view without having the simulation stop. Here again, I'm zooming, rotating, panning without having to pause or uh, disrupt the simulation at any time. After the simulation is complete, we can now see that we have no collisions for this project. Here, if we look at the model, we can see that its integrity is very nicely well defined. There are no choppy lines and overall this model uh, came out very well for this simulation. Last feature that we can do is double click on any colored surface like this chamfer here and NC Simul will call up that tool for every different color that's represented on the model. Here we also have the information tab that gives us the cycle time calculation for every tool and also the cycle time calculation for the entire job. Here we also have the status tab that gives us a detailed report for every block of code in the entire job. Here we can see the comment of this tool, the tool number, the sequence number, the position relative to the machine, and most importantly, the active work coordinate system. Last, I'd like to show you the speed of the simulation in the NP3 player. Here, if I reset and just say display and result, in less than just a few seconds, the simulation runs the entire job. This is how to use the NP3 player ran from an MP3 file of NC Simul Machine.